Maryland basketball lands one of its biggest commitments ever. The Terps landed five-star big man, Derek Queen. Queen is ranked as the 12th best player in the country and the number third ranked center in the country. Queen attends powerhouse Mount Verde in Florida, but is originally from the DMV area. Queen originally attended St. Francis Academy in Baltimore, the same school as two current Terps, freshman Jonathan Lamothe and Maryland star big man Julian Reese. Could Queen and Reese potentially suit up in the front court together next year? If they did, they could be one of the best front courts in the country and in the Big Ten. Queen had a ton of offers, but chose Maryland over Kansas, Indiana, and Houston. It's always good to beat out a fellow Big Ten rival in Indiana, so landing Queen over Indiana is huge because it would be horrible for Kevin Willard and the Maryland team to have to go and play Queen every single year after not landing him. This commitment could not be more big for Kevin Willard. The Terps program had a tough year so far. Maryland is currently 14 and 13 and at the bottom of the Big Ten. Next year, Maryland loses a lot of talent, including star Jameer Young. Maryland also loses Dante Scott, and the Terps need a new influx of talent. Derek Queen will do exactly that for the Terps. He will come in and be a starter right away and should be a potential Big Ten freshman of the year. Year. Even though we have a long way to go until that happens, Queen is that type of player. Queen is one of the most skilled bigs in the 2024 class. He can score, he can rebound, he can pass the ball really well for his size. If you turn on the tape, he can do a lot of different things that will help the Maryland program right away. Queen joins fellow 2024 commit Malachi Palmer, two players who could potentially come in and play right away and have a big impact. Could Kevin Willard potentially rebuild this roster for next year? One thing is for sure. Getting Queen is a great start to building this new roster going into next year and hopefully having a better team and a better record than Maryland has had this year. Get the latest Terps news at InsideMarylandSports.com.